I like on fire. I know, that was another life. That was another life. <laughs> Lord of the Rings. Buenos dias. Na świecie prawdopodobnie 3 miliardy ludzi gra właśnie w role-playing game, z czego 10 milionów to gracze w e, Dungeons and Dragons. Jesteśmy w małosłonecznej Barcelonie? Zobaczmy jak wygląda statystyka w tym mieście. Ja jestem Natasza, a to kanał Gram Przygody z Barcelony. Natasha, where are you from? Okay, uh, from here, from Barcelona. Ah. I am uh, Abdul Zahran. Yeah, I come from Egypt. From here, from Barcelona. I'm from Valencia, and here from uh, here from Catalonia. Which system do you like the most? Like many different systems. I'm, oh, I'm tell actually, me. I'm actually writing one. I am horror. Horror? Oh, yeah. that's great. And sometimes I like mystery. I like mystery a lot. Vampire? Mystery? I thought of playing Godbound. Ars Magica. Dangers and Dragons. Ah, yes. I was playing Dungeons and Dragons. Cthulhu. Cthulhu. Wow, yeah. Uh, War of Darkness. I okay. D&D. D&D. My favorite, personally, is called Cthulhu. Uh, Dungeons and Dragons. Dangers and Dragons. Three full fight. Three little fight. Ah. Are rather a team player or lonely wolf? Uh, well, according to the strategy, I can be sometimes only wolf. Uh -huh. I can also be a team player. How you team can player, call team player? Yeah, yeah. It's a okay. Team, game. <laughs> <laughs> team player. Team player. I like to gather with friends and have some fun with. What, what do you like in uh, uh, narrative games? Uh, now the beauty of it was like letting my imagination free and yeah. actually while playing kind of um, being within the story and the movie kind of situation yeah. so it was more creativity and imagination i what i like most is the the master a good master having a good master well the aspect of um we say the randomness about the fact of that the throws the dice you never know when uh, you're gonna fail or you're gonna have success. My character to be very customized, very specialized in so, the skills. Uh, what do you think is the most vital factor of such uh, narrative games? What is the most uh, important? Games. Mm -hmm. I think the character. I, yeah. I like more uh, games on the on the like character focus and like uh, free role play and uh, less about rules. Yeah, maybe you want to tell us about uh, one of your favorite character uh, playing by you, of course. Yeah. Oh, the favorite character I created. I play the president, and oh. I have to be. I have to choose the characters of the president. So for me, a president have to be a bit not very stiff. A bit what happened is uh, just he very, he's very down to earth. No, so I made him dress. Uh, from Zara, no, so I made a dress. <laughs> have a very Toyota-like car, have this kind of scooter. For playing Barcelona or in Spain, uh, it's very, very small. Do you have your own system? Uh, here we invented uh, Aclarri, who's a role playing game based in, I think, in 1000. 60, uh, 1017. Mm -hmm. uh, it's around playing of uh, uh, wishes, brujas. Mm -hmm. Yeah, wishes. And all this, okay. this, this Spain, this uh, black yeah. Spain okay. of the Middle It's Ages. still p popular? Yes, it is uh, very popular. Wow. And so it's based on uh, Spanish history or European yes. history? Yes. Jesteśmy w porcie forum, skąd żegnamy się z Barceloną. Ale to nie koniec naszej przygody. Natomiast gdzie spotkamy się po raz kolejny, o tym wiedzą tylko Neptun i nasz kapitan. Hasta luego!